Hey everybody, so, alright, day 8, we are managing to do this Vlogtober thing amazingly. Um, I mean it kind of helps because like my buddy Tayron guy is also doing Vlogtober, so I guess in a sense we're kind of motivating each other to do Vlogtober, which is kind of, you know, honestly probably the main reason that both of us have been doing Vlogtober. So, uh, if you haven't already, feel free to go check out his Vlogtober as well, we're kind of both doing this, so... You know, if you want to go check out his Vlogtober, that'd be pretty cool. Uh, if not, you can stay and hang out with mine. So, um, a weird conversation came up at work today, by the way. Uh, <laughs> kind of a strange conversation, and it's like kind of thought-provoking. So, sorry, I'm trying to... My hair's just a mess. I need to get a haircut. Anyway. <laughs> uh, yeah, anyway. So, the weird conversation that kind of came up is... Um, a, a co-worker and I, like, he's, what, we're probably about 30 years age difference. Um, but he always likes to talk and reflect on, like, the older days and stuff like that. And today he was talking about how, like, it didn't used to be so crazy back in the day. And he has this theory, by the way, now. Um, and I mean, it has interesting points for sure. Uh... Anyway, he was basically talking about, like, why the world is so crazy, and he's like, he really, honestly, he told me, um, and I, I, don't, I don't know, he doesn't really believe in organized religion, so this kind of came up, um, was interesting, honestly, to hear from him, um, but he said that the reason that the world probably is so crazy is because of the fact that, um, people have essentially thrown away organized religion and they haven't really replaced it with anything good um they replaced it with like these temporary solutions like tv and money and um what else did he say uh addictive stuff like drugs and stuff like that essentially and um the reason this came up is because we were talking about homelessness and i i mentioned like i was surprised that there was a lot of people that were probably around my age that were like homeless and we were talking about it uh and he said like he kind of has heard when he's been walking by that like they're like oh i'm i'm living off the grid and stuff like that and la di da di da um so he he just thinks that like i mean basically he was like you know people have turned away from religion but they haven't really filled they've been trying to fill this void with like addictive stuff like drugs and stuff like that and so it's making him kind of go downhill stuff like that uh that's essentially what he 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 pretty much summarized it as um probably not probably getting a little lost in translation as i'm trying to tell you guys but it is interesting to kind of think about that like the fact that a society that's turned away from organized religion because we actually are we're becoming smarter than religion um are smarter, smart enough to not fall into the trap of religion and stuff like that, is kind of somehow becoming a worse society because we don't have anything to kind of fill that void now. I don't know. It's it was interesting. I mean, you know, I practice organized religion. My coworker doesn't, so that's why it was interesting to hear from him. Because um, you would think you would hear from somebody like me, but oh well. I don't know. I thought it was interesting. Maybe, maybe it's just all circumstantial and. Who, you know, who knows, really. Uh, but do you have a theory as to why the world is so crazy now? Crazy? Like, stupid... Well, I don't want to say stupid, but, like, terrible stuff happens every day now, like, on the daily, and you pretty much hear it every day. Uh, and people just seem to be getting crazier. I mean, definitely when I'm driving, like, people just... Oh, gosh, this is the one thing I hate when I'm driving. All right. So, okay. So, so picture this is me driving, right? I'm in... I'm in, uh, say, center lane, and then picture... Well, okay. Reverse. Okay, sorry. So, technically, on my side, it's on the right side, but for you guys, I think you're staying on the left side, if I'm looking at this preview properly. Okay, so picture a person in left lane, um, and person does... Like, all the way over into the, like, far right lane. Like, they just cut right in front of everyone. It's just... Ooh, I don't know. People drive insane. Like, I, I tend to usually not drive downtown anymore, um, just because like 
it stresses me out. Uh, cause, like, I always have to be, like, on edge for people who just are driving crazy, who, like, go from left lanes all the way to the far right lane in, like, a quarter of a second and basically disregard everyone who is, uh, behind them or even approaching close to them. I don't know. It's, it's weird. Um, and obviously, like, there's a share of crazy people that just walk on the street and shout at you while you're driving your car and stuff like that. Um, or walk on the sidewalk and start shouting at you. I had a guy, I had a guy one time, like, I was, I had, like, just parked and he came up and knocked on my window. I'm like, why the, why? The world's crazy enough. Why would you knock on someone's window? I mean, I'm not going to do anything, but there could have been someone crazy who just would have been like, boom, stuff like that. I don't know. I'm rambling though. Uh, let me know why you guys think the world is getting a little bit crazier. Um, and, um. Yeah, just just tell me why. Tell me why. Does my coworker's theory hold hold water? Does it not? I don't know. Um, just you know, try and keep it civil. Um, I did talk about religion, so it's gonna be the comments could be less civil, but try and keep it civil. We're not here to be enemies to to each other. Like honestly, um, we're just here to kind of figure out why the world's getting a little crazier. So thanks for tuning in. We'll see you guys tomorrow, and goodbye. I remember him.